Automatic feeder leaves many pets hungry again. By Learn With News. Level 3. In 2018, the company PetNet, which sells an automatic pet feeder, had a malfunction with their Google rented server. The issue caused 10% of their customers' pets to go without meals. The company has now faced the same issue again, but much worse. Instead of being offline for 10 hours, the devices were offline for a whole week. This meant that some pets didn't get any food for a week. PetNet's product is an automatic pet feeder which runs on Wi-Fi. A pet owner can control it using an app on their phone. It allows the owners to be able to either schedule a feeding or feed their pet when they are not at home. The company calls itself the world's first intelligent pet feeder that will program itself around your life and the wellness of your pet. The product runs for $149. The repeated issues with the PetNet feeder have left many customers angry and dissatisfied. This is the third time that PetNet feeders have been disrupted due to technical issues and the company is starting to gain a reputation for being unreliable. 61% of the reviews for the smart feeder on Amazon are negative, receiving either one or two stars. Many of the reviews cite the substandard software as being a reason to avoid the products. Owners of the smart feeder have complained about the app not working, not having basic features, and of not being able to control the feeder outside of the app. One customer called the app the most terribly written mobile app I have ever seen in my life. Complaints about the software side of the device are a constant theme in customer reviews. Another common complaint is the lack of customer support from PetNet when customers do have issues. Many customers have complained of never receiving a response from customer support when they have encountered a problem with the smart feeder. It's uncertain what caused the most recent week-long outage. However, it is certain that PetNet has many disappointed customers.